Okay guys, here's a quick uh, demonstration video of intent and what I mean by it is being the unquantifiable or the unmeasurable. It's really uh, the intent per rep or your setup or your goal for each rep um, for an exercise can be the difference between um, what you get out of a program and then what another trainee can get out of a program. So here for the demonstration, I just had Nat, um, I gave her a few setup cues for where I wanted her feet um, and, the, and the angle and the setup. And then I just said, just do 12 reps as you normally would. So like most trainees, the negative is quite fast. She's thinking I'm gonna get these 12 reps done and get it and get the set done and rest. Um, and she's really searching to finish the set and get it done. So she completes the set in about 30, um, 35 seconds. So then we, we work on a few cues um, and on intent or execution wise. So uh, first off was just control the, the negative, then take all the momentum out of the, at the bottom. And then on the initiation of the contraction or pressing the weight up, I wanted her to think about scraping her foot along the plate of the leg press. Imagine like she's wiping chewing gum off her shoe. Um, and that would just really engage the hamstring and just take it from a momentum based movement um, to a contraction based movement. So her intent here is to really lower the weight against gravity or slow it down and push through the heel. Try and imagine she's wiping that chewing gum off her shoe, but pulling the knee back with the hamstring. So it's just taking a lot of a, a lot of the focus out of momentum and getting the rep done and then set that um, intent into the hamstring on the glutes to initiate the movement. So yeah, I encourage all you guys to ha have a little focus for each and every exercise you do and then think about what's the intent and what's the goal of this exercise.